Okay, so good afternoon. Good afternoon, everyone. Have you guys done your lunch? Okay. I just see some newcomers like uh, Kevin. I think you are uh, you are a newcomer, right? Jamie. Uh, yes. Okay, and how about Amelia? Are you uh, yes. newcomer, right? Okay, so if you don't mind, could you please uh introduce yourself to all of your friends? Yeah, please. Uh, my name is my full name is Lao A. Uh, you can call me Amelia. Uh, I am fourteen years old. I'm from Maguay. Okay, okay, great. Uh, may I know your uh, your background? I was in year eight. Uh, where did you finish uh, the year eight? Yes, teacher. Sure. So where did you finish your year eight? Ah, uh, here. Hear me, Hinda. Yes. Oh, okay. So I think you are the same group with the Hazel, right? Ah, uh, yes. Hazel, uh, Kevin, the same. Oh, okay. Cool. Okay. Okay. So, uh, can I know your ambitions and your hobbies and the other stuff? I like watching movies, listening to music. Oh, yeah. That's all? Yeah. I like swimming too. Sorry? Swimming. I love swimming. Now you love swimming. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so what about your ambition? Or your interest for the future? Uh, I would like to be an architect, uh, a businesswoman. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Okay, thank you. Uh, nice to meet you, Amelia. So my name is Maria. You can call me Teacher Mary. Actually, my name is Timomose, like you. It's a bit long, right? Uh, but you can call me <laughs> Teacher Mary. That that's enough, I think. Okay. Um, Kevin. Uh, if you don't mind, can I see your face? Because we have already set the rules here. Maybe your friends already convey the you know the messages to you, right? What did we done? What have we done yesterday, right? If I'm not mistaken, is there? Am I correct? Yeah. Okay. Okay, Kevin. Uh, if you don't mind, could you please, you bro? <laughs> uh yeah. I I'm I'm Jamie Polo, and my nickname is Kevin. Uh, you you can call me Kevin. Mm -hmm. And uh, I have finished uh year eight in this school also. Okay. Cool. Okay, uh, and may I know the other, you know, hobbies and the other stuff about you? Um, I interest in uh computer science, and I also want to be a, a programmer, a, a graphic designer. Yeah. Okay, I think there are some students who wanna be a programmer, right? So now we have got a gun, like. Four students want to be a programmer, right? If I'm not mistaken, am I correct? Ellie, Kevin, Aung Chan, and who else? I forget it. Tangora or anyone else? Do you know? Um, programmer kitchen the alley. Tangora la. Is that you to me? I think Sorry? I think so. So many English. So. Mela, Sumela, is that you, Sume? Yes. Oh, okay, great. Okay, so uh, now I'm going to do one warm up activity. So, because, you know, this is a lunch time, right? So, after you, you have your lunch, so you might feel like a bit lazy or dizzy or maybe sleepy, right? So, I want to do one activity. So, are you guys are at home right now, right? Is that true? You are uh, in your home, right? Okay, so maybe things are around you, right? Okay, okay, okay. So now uh, we are going to grab the things. Okay, we have to grab the things. Uh, so first of all, I want you to find out 
the umbrella because it is the monsoon here in Indonesia. I'm not too sure about in Myanmar. Actually, it's supposed to be uh, winter, right? But maybe there will be uh, some rain. I, I'm not too sure. Okay. Anyway, so you guys have to bring up your umbrella and show me here. Okay, let's go and find out. Uh, teacher, why umbrella? Yeah, umbrella, please. Okay. Okay, okay, let's go. Teacher, can you yeah. tell me? I lost my connection. Sorry to me? Okay, I got it. Oh, okay. Now I'm going to do uh, some fun game, you know. So in this game, you need to grab the things from your home. So maybe uh, now uh, for, the, for the first turn, I just asked you to find out the umbrella and you have to bring it up here and then show Hi, teacher. The something like that. Teacher? Share. Yeah, uh, umbrella is a little bit hard to get because okay, so you can I don't know. Off. Yeah, it's okay. I don't mind me. No, you can find another yeah. one, but not not this time. It's okay. Uh, thank you. Yeah, pleasure. And can I show my water bottle? Yeah, yeah. later, later. I'm going to ask you to bring something off so you have to find it again. Okay? I found it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, where where is your umbrella guy? Can you show me please? One, two, three, go. Yo, Yang Zongli, yeah, colorful. Okay, great, great. How about Suyer D and Itenda? What about you guys? Okay, great. And how about Kevin? Kevin, can I see yours? Ah, uh, okay, cool. Blue one. Okay, so this time, okay, uh this time you need to find out a spoon. A spoon. Yeah. Let's go and get your spoon. Okay, okay, wait a minute, yeah. Uh, okay, Sh show me your spoon, please. One, two, three, go. Yay, cool. Okay, not different size. Okay, great. Thank you. Um, next one. Uh, next one. The uh, okay. This time, you guys need to find me. What else? Wait, wait. Easy one, please. Uh, yeah. Wait a minute. Okay, this time you find me. Uh, a black pen. A black pen. A black one. I need a black, not a red or a blue. Black one. Okay, okay, wait a minute. Teacher? Yeah? Uh, the delivery has arrived, so can I go and grab that? Yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> Okay, ready? Let's go. Ready, ready? Can you, can I see your uh, black one? A black pen, please. 
black one jim ten and all black you are no blue in my piano no? black black okay how about uh tora <coughs> tora can you find a black one oh, no la okay so sad okay so this time the last time you guys need to find me a cup a cup then i'm gonna take a picture no go and get a cup I got it. Okay, cool. Wait a minute, yeah. Okay, okay, wait, wait. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Here we go. Oh, my one is cannot see la. Okay, anyway. Okay, ready? I'm gonna take picture now. Su yi Okay, okay, great. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, one more. One, two. Three. Okay, great. I'm gonna send you in the group later. Okay, thank you. So how's your feeling right now? Are you guys okay now? Hmm? Yeah. Energetic enough? <laughs> okay, and a little of them, your energetic hit bar we can enough. Can I put the cup back? Sure, sure. Yeah, please take your time. You guys can put it back, no? No, Okay, so shall we start now? Yedi, are you there? Yedi? Okay, so today we are going to talk about um family. Okay, so before we talk about the family, maybe you must know the some vocabulary relating to the family. Okay, it's me family word. So how many of what do you know? You can type me in the chat. You just need to type me only just one word. The word relating to the family. Please type me a word relating to a family like brother, blah, blah, like sister. Yeah, cousins, of course. Yeah, brother, mother. Okay, love, of course. Argue, oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, what is Kanya Kuna? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know that boy, actually. <laughs> okay, okay, it's okay. Okay, um, mother, brother, uncle, auntie, father, yeah. And what else? What else? Uh, stepmom, siblings, grandpa, kindness. Yeah, cool. And then grandparents. Yeah. Okay, what else? What else? If you think about your sibling, uh, the fighting, the war fighting come up into your mind, right? <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, great aunt. Yeah, of course. Uh, nephew, yeah, okay. And then what else? 
niece. Okay, niece, nephew, and how about sharing things? Brother-in-law, sister-in-law, yeah, home, yeah, okay. And, and that's all? No more? Yeah, niece, okay. Welcoming, okay, welcoming what? Welcoming, welcoming people. Bang net, warm, okay. Then, twins, yeah. Bang bed. Uh, could you please tell me about that? Um, so is it his, right? His, uh, yeah, it's kind of like uh, two beds. Like one is at the button and the other one is on the top. Like uh, you can reach on the top by the stair. Ah, oh, okay. Just like my one, okay, here. Then, and what else? Siblings. Okay, I think that's enough, right? So, okay, yeah, the last one, that's it. Then uh, now we're going to work on chapter one. Today we are going to talk about family. So let's go to, wait. Uh, let's go to page number eight in your test book. Please go to page number eight. Uh, teacher, I haven't got the book yet. How many of you haven't got the textbook yet? Raise hand, please. Just two, three, uh, four. Okay, then. Uh, so I'm going to share you now here. You can read it now. Now, this is screen. This is a bit high. So, Palu Yama, no? Matali Papi, no? Okay. Having any questions, stop. Yeah, I forgot to. Okay. There you will see the sum phrase of all. If you don't know some what you can line up or you can note down. If you guys finish reading, type me B in the chat. B stands for bingo, okay? If you had read, you have to type me B in the chat. Here's a, uh, can you see the screen, right? So if needed, I will share you the... PDF, not me, no worry. But first, try to read on the screen first. No? Uh, okay. 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 Okay.
<laughs> okay, done. Uh, I have seen three of you done. Four done. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Nine, ten. Ten. Eleven. Okay. 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 So uh, here, Ellie sent me some word that she doesn't know. Uh, is there any word that you doesn't know? Uh, please uh, type me in the chat, like like Ellie. If you want to know that word, please type me in the chat. Uh, teacher, do I need to send uh, those lists with everyone? No, it's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Okay, if you guys don't know some word, uh, let me know. Okay. Okay, so let me tell you one, get on well with, I think, right? Get on well, get on well with me. Anyone who has a idea for get on well? I think it's along, get along with someone. Get along with someone, it means that you have a good relationship with someone else, right? So it's we call like get on. And Q, what is a Q? To start something. It's a line, kind of line, okay? Lined up, mean kind of like lined up. If you are going, if you go to like coffee shop, you lined up, right? And waiting for your coffee. So it's kind of like you. And maternal, maternal mean like mother side. For example, maternal grandpa mean like the, the grandpa from your mother side. It's we call like maternal. Okay, uh, Ellie got it, the mean? Uh, yeah. Okay, and next one is get away with. Okay, get told off, get away. Matana, I think I have already explained, right? So uh get told off here. Okay, get told off me scold. Someone scold you. Okay, get told of me, scold. Okay, then get away, get away me, escape with something. Escape. Okay, got it. Okay, so let's see here. Um, wait. Uh, here you will see two words like uh maternal, paternal. Okay, uh, this mean that the maternal grandfather me grandfather from your mother side, paternal grandmother me grandmother from your father side. Okay, so there you will see the two words. Okay, so any questions so far? Any word that you don't know? Any word that you don't know here in the test? Any questions so far? No? Nothing. Okay. Okay. So, um, do I need to explain everything in detail or you got the point? So what about Dan? Can you please tell me about Dan? Where, where does he live? Uh, what about him? How many family members has he got? Blah, blah, blah. Could, could you please tell me some about Dan? Uh, he lived in Liverpool. Yep. Uh, with the with his parents and 10 siblings. 10 siblings, so uh, in total, how many family members has he got? I would say 12. 12, of course, yeah, of course, yeah. And then? <coughs> they sometimes yeah. argue with each other. Of course, yeah. 
but mostly they get along well. Yeah. Okay, then what else? If there is an argument, the whole will be very noisy, right? Of course, yeah, there are so many uh, family members, right? So that's why, yeah, of course, uh, sometimes it can be noisy. Sometimes uh, it can waste the time by, you know, lined up by lining up at the, you know, uh, bathroom or something like that. So, yeah, of course, it takes really time not to get a shower because you have to wait long. Okay, so uh, this is all about Dan, right? So anyone who would like to talk about me, the second one. Uh, check, can I? Yeah, please. Uh, Juan, Juan is living in Shenyan and he is the only child. Uh, and he, he, have, he, he don't have, uh, he, sorry, she doesn't have any uh, cousin, aunt or uncle, but she never feel only because uh, she have all the way friends uh, with her and uh, her grandparents look after uh, when she was she was a little and uh, she was very close to uh, maternal grand grandparents grandmother and yeah Oh uh, yeah, she she stay visit to uh her grandparents' house okay. in holidays. Okay, great, thank you. So it's mean that she's the only one, only child, right? So it's mean that she doesn't have any brothers or sister. She's alone, right? So but uh she never feel like she's lonely because she has lots and lots of many friends. So she never feel like she is lonely. And another one is that um, when she was young, I mean that when she was little, when she was young, she lived with her grandparents. I think uh, it's from her mother's side. I mean that from mother's side, right? So uh, she's very close to her grandmother and she sometimes visits to her grandparents, on in, especially in the holidays. So it's all about who are. Okay, then how about Yusuf? Anyone who would like to talk, tell me about Yusuf? Okay. Uh, Ellie and another one is who? Wait, me. Lilala. Lilala. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Lilala. Okay, so Lilala first. Then the sec. The last one will be Ellie. Ellie, is it okay? Yes. Okay. Okay, Lilala, please. Okay, Shane. Uh, Yusuf lived in Tunis. Um, he he lived. Uh, he lives with his parents and his three brothers. Um. Uh, he he pressure he pressure to do well, um, at school and he do a lot uh, a lot of homework. Um, and he has lots of homework to do then. Oh yes. Um. He, um. He. His parents. Um. His parents. Uh. His parents work. Uh, and he. He. He is the oldest in. Uh. In his family. Um. He has the youngest. Youngest brother. Spoil me like naughty, right? Yes, naughty. Yeah, kind his, of like uh, naughty. his youngest, uh, his youngest brother is naughty. He doesn't. He doesn't like it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, so let me recap about Yusuf. Uh, Yusuf live in the Tunis with his parents and his three brothers. So he is the eldest one. Okay. Uh, maybe he. Uh, I think, uh, he has a five family member, and then he is the the uh how do we call it the elders in, in his sibling so and next one he has a lot of pressure because he has to do lots of homework at school and then uh and also he has to take care of his brother because uh his parents are at work all the time and and next one is that uh he think he thought that his youngest brother is the naughtiest one ever <laughs> because uh he always escaped 
and then he never school up scolded by the parents right so that is why he really i mean i mean he doesn't like his brother the youngest brother so this is all about you so and can you tell me about salma uh ellie oh uh, yeah uh, she lives in dubai with her parents and brother and her brother is even 10 years older than her uh, and she he's already married and but she also has a nephew uh, yeah that's it okay so she's only 14 years old and she has yeah. uh, only one sibling her brother and but her brother is already married and they have got a uh, nephew uh, sorry they have got a um a, a boy right a boy right so uh, she has a nephew uh some uh, so that's why she become an aunt and no okay and but uh sometimes uh the people uh, the friends think that it is quite funny because she's only 14 and she's an aunt you know so that is why um she's being teasing by her friends but she doesn't mind that and also um her nephew is only just six weeks old and he's so cute so i think that he's she really loved uh her nephew right so maybe she she loved her family as well okay so i think you guys got these all points right uh, i really hope you got all the points then we are going to work on number two so which of the followings are employed or mean that employ mean that mentioned in the test so which of the following is mentioned in the test? So you guys need to figure it out by reading these sentences and find out these facts in the you know text. If you see it, yeah, you have to tell me yes. If no, is you have to tell me no. Okay, so any questions so far? No. Okay, so let's do it now. I'm gonna give you uh five minutes. If you finish, you can raise your hand. Uh, teacher, do yeah. you also have to do number three? Wait, wait, wait. I'm going to, uh, uh, I'm going to check number two first to me. Oh, yeah. Amelia and Itenda, the middle finish. Yeah? Yes, sir. Okay, let me ask one by one. Start from Koyi on Chambai. Koyi, can you please tell me number one, da? Uh, Dan doesn't mind doing job at home. Uh, yes, it's implied. So, in which line, in which sentence tell you that point? Uh, the second sentence. Second paragraph, second sentence, right? Yes. This one, right? We all have to help with the jobs around the house, right? Is that correct? 
Ku Yang Chan Bai, eh? Yes. Okay. Uh, if you guys agree with Ang Chan Bai, type me A in the chat, please. Type me A in the chat. If you have the same idea, please type me A in the chat. Okay, great. Ang Chan, can you choose one, please? Quickly, no? Da, no, do you have to do it? Ah, Lenezo. Okay, Lenla, number two. Uh, Dennis' parents are very strict. No, chef. No, don't mention in the in the text, text, right? So we can't find anything else. Okay, okay. If you guys agree with Linla, type me L in the chat. Linla stand for L, right? <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, Linla, choose one, please. Um, yes, three. Yes. Okay, Nyesu. Yes, um, it wasn't mentioned there. Can you read the sentence, please? Um, who did you share? Oh, here. Uh, but I have never felt lonely because I have always had lots of friends. Yeah, but in three, she mentioned that she said because she hasn't got any brother and sister, but actually. She never felt lonely, right? So here, according to the test here, no? So, okay, it is not correct. It's not mentioned. Okay, then uh, next one, please, to me. Um, Idra. Okay, Idra, number four. Uh, I think it's true. True, uh, according to? According to which line? Uh, uh, second. I mean, seven. Line number seven. Okay, so I'm very close to La. Right? This one, no? No way. Hello, hello. Is that true, Mai Kitenda? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so uh, next one. Either now choose one, please. Me, eh? Uh, three, two. Okay. Um, true. Why do you think so? Oh, uh, Lisa, can you show me? Uh, yeah. Uh, because uh, he mentioned that he doesn't have much time for his own interest, and there's a lot of pressure to do well at school. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah, according to a lot of pressure, right? Okay, then next one, please. Uh, test reason. Okay, test reason. Uh, yes, I think it's not mentioned. Uh, test reason, if you don't mind, read number six to me. Oh, yeah. Yusuf thinks his parents are not always fair in the way they treat the children. Okay, so what do you think? Uh, it is not mentioned in the test. Okay, if you guys agree with her, type me. Type me in the mail, wait. Uh, yeah. Okay, if you guys agree with test reason, type me H in the chat. If you agree with test reason in the chat, please. H in the chat, please. Okay, so I think you guys agree with that point, right? So you guys can see this point in the chat, right? Because uh, in the last sentence, the me, so I'm the oldest one, and I think my youngest brother is boy, but he never get toes off, meaning that he never scolded by his parents. He always escaped, right? So it means that um, even though he is a spoil, he is a naughty, he never get toes off. So it, it, it's me that he feel like unfair, right? Okay, then, so uh, yeah, we can we can imagine that, uh, we, we can know that by checking out that text, no? You so be in that way, yeah? yeah. Then number six, number seven, next one. Choose any, choose one, please. Uh, kind Tora. Kind Tora, yeah, Tora. I'm not getting somewhere with her parents. It wasn't nice. It didn't mention, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so if you guys agree with Tora, type BK in the chat. If you think correct, type BK. Uh, Selma gets on well with her parents. Here, they don't much mention about the parent, but uh, the thing they highlight, it's only a uh, brother, right? So I can say that it's correct, yeah. They don't mention much about it. Okay, then next, number eight, uh, Tora, the last one, choose me one. Ellie. Okay, Ellie. Uh, yeah, Selma is annoyed at her friend's reaction to her being a knot. I think uh, it didn't mention in the text. Oh, yeah, yeah it, isn't, uh, it isn't correct. Actually, it's not correct, right? So yeah. they don't mention in that way, right? So she's quite okay, right? She's okay being a uh, aunt, okay? So number eight is wrong and number eight is not mentioned. Okay, thank you guys. So I hope that you guys got the same idea. Is that true? Or any questions so far for number two? Any questions? No. No. Okay, let me go to next part, vocabulary. Um, this time, you guys need to find out the word in the test for the following. For example, number one. Uh, Yadi, can you, get, can you tell me the answer for one to me? So, Yadi. Uh, the son of your stepmother or stepfather. So, what is it? In law, hey, no law. Stepmother and stepfather. Uh, the same. Father so it will be your step brother. Oh, step brother. Oh, sorry. Yeah, step brother. In law, go away. I go away. Ma, I go away. Jure hari al. In law, if you know. No, da. Ah, midwiru parua alu palare haso. The son of your stepmother and stepfather. So it about the same. Step brother piano like that. Okay, so can you guys find me two to eight now? If you guys then type me B in the chat, it stands for bingo no? Or you can resend, yeah, it's up to you. Okay, so how many of you guys then? Let me share one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, ten. Can I ask you one by one now? Are you guys ready? Yes, yeah. Okay, so this time, Ellie, choose one, please, B. Uh, do I have to 
say different one, one. Different one, yeah. But teacher? Sorry? But do I only need to call for someone to say the answer? Or do I yeah, also yeah, need... yeah. You have to pick up one. Because you have done number eight, right? So this, oh, yeah. this time you have to call out one, yeah. Ang Chen Pak. Okay, Ang Chen. I think Ang Chen already done lah. Ang Chen already done. Let me choose a different one, please. Nyasu uh, Yes, Nyasu already done, I think. Kevin. Kevin. Okay, Kevin, number two, da. Uh, stepsister. The daughter of your stepmother or step. Father is stepsister. Okay, great. And choose one, please. Uh, Pizzo. Okay, Pizzo. Number three. Uh, someone without brothers or sisters, only child. Yeah, the only child. Okay, great. And next one, please. Uh, Suyedi. Suyedi already done that. Choose one. Choose different one. Uh, Sume English. Okay, English number four. My English. Siblings. Siblings, yeah, correct. Now, brother and sister, sibling. Okay, let me choose one, please. Hi, Dora. Hi. Kind daughter. Kind daughter. Okay, number five to me. Your aunt and uncle's children, cousins. Cousins. Okay, and choose different one. Choose next one. Amelia. Amelia. Okay, number number six to me. Uh, your mother's mother, grandmother. Grandmother. Okay, it bad. You have to tell me like mother and grandmother because it's your mother's side, right? So. Maternal grandmother. Okay, then next one. Let me choose one. Uh, well. Yeti. She? I think Yeti. Sorry, what? Yeti. Oh, Yeti. Yeti, yeah, call it down and do it. Not Yeti. Ah. Yeti, you will call it down and do it. Okay, my yadi de uh the chat in a either nama be the can la lo hola my e uh I already done. Have you done? Yes. Oh uh, okay, yadi, okay, that not the jaw tene. Okay, yadi, start from you again. Uh okay. I think uh is that your mother's mother is grandmother, right? Uh it's already done the me, number seven. My sister in law, I think so. Or your brother's wife. Your brother's wife is what? Sister in law. Yes, yeah, sister in law. Brother brother's wife be sister in law. Correct. Okay, choose one please to me. Uh either. Either da. Either da, either da. Um, am I right? Yeah. Uh, I think nephew. Sorry? Nephew. Nephew, ne. Okay. My brothers or sisters and nephew. Okay, great. Okay, let's do number four. By the way, you got all the answer now. Number three, if you go my mother, la. Okay, so let's continue number four. So this time you guys need to match the word and their definition. Okay, for example, this side is uh, the word. Okay, they mentioned the word, but this is the explanation actually. This is the definition. So you guys need to match with this one. Okay, let's do it now. You have uh, two minutes.
What is B? B for bola. What does it mean, B? <laughs> okay, just kidding, not B for bingo. Okay. Okay, for uh, number four, guys, uh, can you guys tell me your father's mother? What is it? Uh, all and mute, please. And mute your mic and tell me all together. Okay, and mute, please. Yeah, and mute your mic and then tell me the answer. Number one, uh, your father's mother. Paternal grandmother. Paternal grandmother. Okay, then your mother's father. Maternal grandmother. Maternal grandmother. Yeah, and then your sister's husband. Brother in law. Brother in law. And your brother's or sister's daughter. Okay, so uh, this is time for speaking. Before we go to the next part, before we do the reading, uh, okay. let me check. Yeah, I already got the breakout section. So now, uh, I will divide you into here, uh, all together 13, right? 13. Uh, teacher, yep. can I say something? Uh, can I go grab my mouse? Sorry, what? Can I go, uh, grab my mouse? Okay, okay, sure. Uh, so guys, uh, I'm gonna make you into a group of four. Okay, in each in each group there will be a three students. Okay, so in your group you guys have to chit chat. It's kind of like a fan talk. Okay, so you need to share about your family. Okay, you just need to mention about your brother, sister, or your feeling, or your daily. How do I say? How do I say? How do you spend your time with your family? You can mention about your family relating to your family. So I'm gonna give you only just for five minutes. So with, uh, not five minutes, sorry, and 10 minutes. Each person will get two minutes or maybe around three minutes. So it's up to you, you have to manage it yourself. Okay, so uh, please make sure that you give a chance to other to tell you, to share about their family. Okay, you don't need to take only, to, uh, you don't need to take like 10 minutes, the whole 10 minutes for you, no? You have to give them a chance to speak. Okay, so let me make it into a uh, four group, right? So. So by the way, any questions so far? Are you are you guys clear about my instruction? Okay, let's go. Can we ask each other question more than this? Or Sorry? do we only need to ask this? Like, you don't need to uh, ask the only... question. Let them share. Let them share about their family. And then later after that, you want to know more? Yeah, of course, you can ask them freely. It's kind of like the fan talk. It's like a chit-chatting, right? Okay, so it's up to you. If you wanna know more, you can ask them questions. So I will give you 10 minutes. Within 10 minutes, uh, make sure every everybody speak. Okay, and don't close your camera, no? Okay, let's go. My sweet on, please try.
Hey, we are here. Yeah. But only three. <laughs> Maybe nobody loved their breakout role. Yeah. I think like all of them like have four people that only add have like three. No, I think uh all rooms got three members except one because in total we have uh thirteen members, so thirteen classmates. Uh, by the way, Hazel, do you have a pet? No. Oh. Uh, actually, my brother uh, used to adopt the pet, uh, especially the dog. But, you know, it's kind of a big responsibility for us. <laughs> so my mother, her, my mother doesn't allow him to adopt the pet yet. Oh, how about you? Uh, I have a cat. But yeah, what is it? actually, I we don't give him a name. <laughs> okay. What about Amelia? Do you have any pet? I have two dogs. Oh, cool. What do you do? You guys love like dogs or cats? Like I prefer dogs. Oh, I because I think like cats literally go everywhere. Like they don't even stay in the house. It's not cuddly at all. So. Yeah. No worry. Yeah, next time I'm gonna do debate about like keeping a cat as a pet and keeping. A dog as a pet, no? So later you guys can do a debate on that topic. Okay? But teacher, I hate both of cats. Eh, but you have a cat, right? Yeah, I do have because my brother loves it. Oh, okay. Not for you. You don't love it? Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, guys, welcome back. So I hope that you guys know each other well, right? So I think you already asked lots of questions to your friend as well, right? So is there anyone who would like to share me about your friends? If you don't mind, could you please share me about your friend? Maybe just one or two. I just want to hear from you. Okay. Yeah, please. Uh, so for Am um, Chen Bai, I heard like he is the oldest uh, among uh, like all his siblings and he has a 10 years old brother and also um, uh, he had a dog that it died like three years ago. Oh, okay. Okay, that's all? My Yeti, that's all? Uh, there is, uh, I think his like maternal grandparents are in US or something. Mm -hmm. And he has US or something. Like, <laughs> US or something we were <laughs> uh in US I think and like his uh cousin is in Bangkok, I think. And he has shared a lot of other more information, but I could only note down some of them. Okay. Okay, the me Yeti, thank you for sharing. So anyone else? Anyone who would like to share about your friend? How about the guy? We have uh four or three guys, uh three guys, right? So who would like to share me? Yo, 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 bro, <laughs> yo, what's up, bro? <laughs> Okay, tell me about your friend, guys. 
Who would like to share me about your friend? Pick up just one, then show me. Please, MD, or Aung Chan or Kevin, who would like to share? You can share me Toto and Toto Lee, no? Uh, you don't need to, it, it doesn't need to be a long, okay? You, you don't need to tell me a long story. Just, just Toto and Toto. It's okay. I don't have a chance to listen to my partner's uh, story. Oh, because yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, I got uh, it. Uh, Zimbi uh, had, has four siblings. Uh, who, 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 sorry, again? Uh, yeah, it's like, I mean, four family members. Yeah, who, who are you talking I mean, about? Who are you talking about? Zimbi. Zimbi. Oh, Zimbi. Okay, okay. Tell me then, yeah. Uh, like... He has uh, four family members, and I think he has like two siblings. I mean, the two or one sibling. Is that true, Cindy? You have uh, two siblings? I got one brother. You got one brother. It means two siblings. Okay, then. And, and. Uh, actually, I, I forgot to write down. Uh, the other information that he gave. Uh, I, I heard that he had a, he has two dogs, right? If I'm not mistaken. Right? Oh, last indeed. Is that true? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then what else? Okay. So anyone who would like to share one more? No one. Okay, by the way, uh, if you have uh, siblings recently, if you have siblings recently, okay, great. Uh, so what about uh, Vanessa, Linla, Suyadi, Amelia? You guys are only child. In your family? Only child, but I have like cousins. Oh uh, yeah, you have so many cousins. Ah uh, uh, yes, I have like five or six. Five six cousin. Oh, it's cool. How about Amelia? I'm not, I'm not only child. Mm -hmm. So guys, uh, do you do you enjoy your life without a cousin or without brother or sister? Emilia, Yedi, and Vanessa? Yes, no, sure. I have a sibling. I have a brother. Oh, so yeah, do you have a brother? Uh, no, no I think Amelia. it's Amelia. It's sure. Amelia. Oh, Amelia. Okay, sorry, sorry. I, I don't see your raising hand. Okay, you are raising hand. Okay, Suredi and Vanessa, what about your feeling, guys? Girls? I am okay. Okay. How about Vanessa? Don't you feel no. lonely? No. Because no. I have so many cousins. Uh, you also have a many cousins. So uh, it means that there is no sibling. It means that you don't need to share anything to them right it's very good right you get everything that you want from your parents right so it's cool yeah for me i also have one brother he is two years older than me and as you know i'm a saturday born he is also sunday born so we always fight each other and we have got our property and he also has his property so it's like a kind of like i also have my own defense you know so when I was young, I, I collect uh, lots of, you know, toys. And also, how do we call it? Uh, the, uh, how do we call it? Um, lottery ticket, you know. So I, I use it as my money, you know. So I use it as my money, you know. So now we, we are getting older and now he already get married. And he has a, he has a son. So uh so it is my nephew, right? So I really love him. 
and uh, but uh, till now we still fighting <laughs> so uh, so yeah because uh, you know Saturday and Sandy Bond yeah always fighting like that yeah young but he's not my younger brother he is my elder brother but he's behaved like a younger brother he's not he uh, he's not mature enough you know <laughs> okay anyway so um okay I think it's time to continue our lesson again no okay so now we are going to read about twins twins reunited so if you want to know more about samantha and uh samantha and, and how do we pronounce that wait let me let me check i have already noted down the french name wait or uh, her name is and anna is bodier now so this is a french name anna is bodier Okay, so this is a French name, and then I think it's quite hard to pronounce, so I just note it down. Okay, so uh, if you want to know more about them, you can search in the Google, or you can you can watch their, you know, documentary, kind of like documentary in the YouTube, no? So it's kind of like interesting. Okay, anyway, so now we are going to read about them. Okay, it's on page number 10. It's Samantha and... Samantha and Anais, okay. If you don't know some word, you can line up. Or if you have some question, you can line up. Okay, let's read it now. Only 10 minutes left. So uh, as a homework, and now you guys need to read this one. Later after that, uh, you need to walk me on number two. Okay, so, okay, before, uh, okay, let's see number two first. Uh, this story originally appeared with the three bullet points below the headline. Uh, you know the bullet point? So this is we call like a bullet point, okay? It's kind of like a gist, okay? So it makes something, uh, how do I say? It makes the reader uh, to understand very, you know, easily. You know, it makes everything easier. So, uh, so... The story originally appeared with the three bullet points below the headline. So the bullet point summarize is kind of like summarizing. You don't need to mention everything from the text. You just need to pick up the, you know, uh, the, the, the important points only. And then you just make it into a summarizing. Okay, this is a feature of some online new reportings and read the story and complete the three points. So they have already started some. You have to... Continue the sentences. Okay, so this will be the homework. It will be homework. So, uh, you for now you you guys have to read this one first. No, that is yellow bar. I tell you, I do what I got. I got a book. Me, I lay reading never yet. I book. Um, be sure. Yes. Okay. After the class, can you send the class book? Sure, sure. I will send you. No worry. Yeah. <laughs> Please remind me, you no, know, after the class, not that. Oh, I, I will send you now. Wait. Uh, this is... Mm-hmm. 
Okay, I have shared the textbook and also workbook now. So uh, I think now you can download the textbook for a workbook, uh, it will take time. I like me similar to, uh, I like me like, how do I say, like we have a, a same shape, uh, same, same eye, same nose, something like that. So it's kind of like what is like. And mannerism, mannerism me, um, how do we call it? Kind of like a behavior. Uh, how do I say? Yeah, kind of like that. You know, you, 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 you like this one and I also like that one. Or maybe you like to do this one. I also like to do that one. Something like that. No? Mannerism. So, then you have to be honest with you. I'm a genie. I'm a genie. I'm a genie. Habits. I'm a genie. No? I'm a genie. I'm a genie. I'm a genie. I like that. I'm a genie. 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 Okay, I think I should stop here today. Okay, so I have already shared you the textbook in, in our group chat. So please feel free to download it. So I have already shared a textbook and also workbook. So please download it. Then we're gonna continue tomorrow. Okay, don't forget to do your homework. Okay, read and uh, uh read and what, what you have to do, sorry. Uh, you have to complete the sentences, right? So read and complete the sentences bullet points okay so guys thank you for coming today see you tomorrow yeah okay bye bye see ya yeah bye bye